I'm Mike Sullivan and today we'll talk about a very common mistake that people make when they try to fix their slice. So, um, so in talking about slicing, it's, it's really something that a lot of times when I talk to people and ask them what they're working on, they'll say they're working on slicing or stopping the slice. And when I, when I ask them what they're working on, what they tell me usually is, and, and I'll show you back here in a second, they say to me that they're trying to bring the club back away from the ball more inside the target line. If you don't know what that, if you don't know what that means, I'm going to show you in a second. But they try to bring the club back to the inside so that they can swing the club from the inside. So if that sounds like terminology to you that you've not heard of before, then I'm going to explain it in a second. If you had heard of that terminology before and it makes sense to you that you should bring the club back inside so you can swing from the inside, then make sure you pay attention here because I'm going to show you how actually it's a lot easier to swing the club from the inside if you take it back more outside. And that could sound confusing, but I'm going to clarify right now. So let's talk about first what happens when somebody tries to bring the club back to the inside. And what I mean by that is if you look at this, these sticks on the ground, they represent my target line. So if I were to make a backswing and my club was parallel to my target line while it's parallel to the ground, that would be on plane, we call on plane. If the club comes back so that the butt end points out to the right out there, we would call that more of an inside takeaway. And if the club comes back so that the butt end points to the left for a right handed golfer, that would be more of an outside the line takeaway. Okay? So it's very common, it's very, very intuitive for people to actually work on the wrong thing here. They think because they want to swing the club from the in to out this way, because if they get the club traveling this way, what's going to happen is they're going to hit the ball, the club moves outside a little bit, and it puts draw spin on the ball, and that would be a good thing. So they think, though, that they want to come back here so they can swing from the inside. The trouble is, with your swing plane, what we call real flat like this, if I were going to make a, a return swing through, I would actually miss the ball completely. I'd be above it. So my correction to hit the ball with a flat back swing would be an over the top move and you can see that club coming from outside the target line. That's going to be a slicing swing path. So what we want to do is, is the opposite. We want to make a back swing where if anything the swing plane is a little bit upright. See here how the low end of the club points inside the target line? From here it's really easy to get back to the ball by dropping under the previous swing plane and swinging out away from you into out and that's going to give us a draw okay so here's how we're going to do it we're going to take a look at where we are naturally oh that's no good that's too far inside that's what I want so I'm going to go nice and slow and try to get a handle on this once I can do it three or four times I'm going to hit a couple shots when you first start hitting shots this way, you're probably still going to bring it back to the inside if that was your problem before. All right? But what's really important here is the intent also. People are trying to hit shots where they're bringing the club back too far inside. They're never going to get things really figured out well. So understand and know on the downswing we want to come from the inside, but we don't want to do it by bringing the club back behind us getting flat. So let's see how we can do here. Not bad, I actually pulled it a little bit from the get-go, worked out really well. So in order to stop slicing and get this figured out the correct way, again, get that club coming back so you're on plane where the club is a little bit outside of your hands here, that's going to make it a lot easier for you to swing from the inside of the target line and get rid of that slice. If 
you like this video, go ahead and give us a thumbs up for a like. And if you subscribe to our channel, you'll be notified by email each time that we produce a new instructional video. Talking about the slice. Stop.